Officials with the Charleston Police Department say the police department there say their team is working to better serve and build trust with the Hispanic community here. As the number of Spanish speakers continues to grow in the low country, Charleston police have added a new position to connect with these members of our community. Our Autumn Klein sat down with the new Hispanic community coordinator for CPD and she joins us live from outside the department to tell us more about this new role. Good morning. Good morning, Shelby and Katie. I spoke with Peter Gazar, who is taking on the brand new role of Hispanic Community Coordinator here at CPD. He tells me that this role is all about giving a voice to the Hispanic population and meeting any needs or concerns that they may have. Gazar formerly served as a victim advocate here at the department and found that they had a lot of Hispanic victims. He says that when a Spanish speaker was there for these victims, it made them feel much more seen and heard. Their hope is to foster and build trust between the Charleston Police Department and the Hispanic community while also breaking those language barriers. And they already have some projects in mind. For example, they are hoping to get involved with the Hispanic youth in the schools here, build partnerships with organizations who are already working with the Hispanic population, and they hope to host educational workshops informing the community about their legal and victims' rights. Gizar emphasized that the one thing they will never do is ask for legal status. They just want to build that relationship and trust. Overall, their hope as a department is to better serve their community, and Gizar is excited to see what they accomplish. I'm honored to be part of, of um, a great team. I'm honored to be part of great leadership. Um, and I think just the fact that, you know, the department wanted to open this role, it, it really speaks volumes to how this agency operates. You know, they, they want to better serve their community, and this is just one way uh, in, in connecting with that community. So, so in español, este, um, estamos aquí para servir, para apoyar, y cualquier cosa le vamos a dar con todo a, con la comunidad latina. One way that the department will be connecting with the community here soon is through their National Night Out event. This is an event full of games and prizes and will take place the evening of August 6th at Joseph P. Riley Park to give CPD an opportunity to connect with the community that they serve. Live in Charleston, Autumn Klein, Live 5 News.